Tonight, NASA hosted a welcome home party for the astronauts who returned to Earth from their most recent missions to space. Yeah, it includes the two astronauts who became famous for going to space for a two-week trip that turned into nine months. Matt Doherty with the exclusive interviews tonight. As is customary for astronauts returning from their missions, this group was greeted with red roses tonight before a crowd of more than a thousand. Yeah. You miss it. Even yeah. though you're all there for so long, you still yeah. miss it. It's a special place. We met with the four astronauts before the event tonight at Space Center Houston. To wake up and go, oh, I'm not floating anymore. That's a shame. <laughs> Sunny Williams and Butch Wilmore were aboard Boeing Starliner for its first manned test flight to the International Space Station. Their two week trip turned into 286 days in space. I knew like we we're going to get home at some point in time. You know, we just got to wait for the right, right ride and make sure everybody's all good with that and we'll, we'll get home. Along with Williams and Wilmore in the space station was Don Pettit, who spent seven months, and Commander Nick Haig, who spent six. Remembering being stuck in my apartment with my ex-girlfriend during the pandemic, that was a long time to be around somebody. Like you said, you're thrown together day and night, seven days a week, 24 hours a day. And just like any family, I mean, there's a point where, you, you know, something rubs you the wrong way or something, that happens anywhere. But I would say that's... That's, uh, uh, for us anyway, it was, it was minor. Well, the, the we key. sent you guys outside twice. Yeah. So, yeah. I <laughs> mean, that, yeah, it gives you more elbow room inside. <laughs> the astronauts say they were in constant contact with support on the ground, including teams of medical doctors, psychologists, and psychiatrists. That support has continued in the months since the astronauts returned. I still got a little twinge in one spot of my back after a couple of months. As their bodies have had to readjust to Earth. And it appears tonight they're doing well as they've come back to Earth, but ready to go back. From the Johnson Space Center, I'm Matt Doherty, KHOU 11 News. I think Sunni's hair is the most famous part of the whole trip. <laughs> I've always said that. <laughs> really something. Glad to have him back. Oh, my God. I could imagine being stuck in space with you guys for that long. Yeah. Did you say you could you? not? You could I could not, not and second. I love you. I mean, but then again, we've been through some hurricanes mm. together, and I would say that's... Harvey, yes, I think one yeah, more. Yeah. We survived that. That felt like we, we were in space anything. for nine that months. We can survive anything. You got that right. Hey, 